All right, guys, this is Sean with the Brothers Workshop. I know we did a video regarding the um, temperature sensor here on these trucks. It'll be your GMC Sierra 1500, your Chevy Silverado 1500 with the uh, 5.3 liter V8 and the 4.3 liter V6. If you guys replace that sensor and you have uh, an issue for some reason, even if you've replaced the thermostat as well, you guys are going to want to take that Teflon tape out because sometimes that Teflon tape will uh, create a barrier from the sensor reading properly. So go ahead and remove that. Another thing that you guys are going to need to do is disconnect the battery. By disconnecting the battery, you guys are going to reset the computer in the truck and it will start to read the new equipment that you've put in properly. And you guys should have no problems. Now I know there's a lot of people out there saying you shouldn't use Teflon tape because that Teflon tape creates a barrier that prevents the sensor from reading correctly. I had absolutely no issues. The only reason we traded patches in is because of a major, major, major water leak. And if you're interested in that, that video is linked right here. But dialing it back, we had replaced that sensor for almost six months and we've had absolutely no issues. The truck ran phenomenally, ran great, and I used that Teflon tape. But that just goes to show you how sensitive these things are. So with that in mind, go ahead and take a look at your truck, see if maybe that Teflon tape is the issue, or maybe you need to reset the motor, or maybe you haven't yet replaced that thermostat. That video is linked right here. Go ahead and do all of that before you guys get upset and you should have no problems whatsoever. Until next time, guys, thanks for watching. Go ahead and like this video, share it with your friends who are having this issue, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.